hey guys welcome back to another video hope you all are doing good so in today's video we are going to see how to identify and protect your pc from viruses and malware so let's start the video first open task manager and check if there is any suspicious software is running in the background so to open the task manager press Control key shift key and skip key on your keyboard now in the process column Click on this name section and this will arrange all the applications and background processes. Now here you have to check if there is any unknown application or any suspicious application which is running and consuming so much of your CPU percentage or your memory percentage or your network percentage. Immediately close that application. So to close any application just right click on it and click on this option and task and this will immediately close that application. After that go to this option startup apps and this will show you all the startup applications now you have to check if there is any suspicious application is showing and disable all the startup applications as well so to disable any startup application just right click on it and select disable so you have to disable all the startup applications as well now move on to the next step so in the next step, we are going to uninstall suspicious and unknown software from our system. So to uninstall any application, open control panel or you can click on this search box and type control and you will get this result control panel. Click on it. Now go to this view by section and select large icons. Then click on this option program and features. And this will show you all the applications which are installed in your system. So if there is any application, if there is any suspicious and unknown application is installed in your system, immediately uninstall that application by right click on it and then click on uninstall. So uninstall all the suspicious and unknown applications from your system. Now it's time to remove all the viruses from your system. So in Windows 10 or Windows 11, you will get a preloaded antivirus. I will show you how to use that antivirus to remove viruses from your system. Just click on this search box and type Windows security. You will get this option Windows security. Click on it. So these are the some features you can use to protect your system. Go to this option virus and threat protection. And here you will get this option scan options. Now there are four type of scan, but you can use this full scan or you can use this offline scan, Microsoft Defender antivirus. So this is the offline scan you can use. Select this option and then click on scan now. So this will restart your system and scan your PC in the offline mode or you can go for this full scan. Okay. Now here one important thing, make sure your antivirus is up to date. So you can update this antivirus as well. So go to this option. Uh, click on this option check for updates so make sure your antivirus is up to date and this antivirus also provides ransomware protection in windows you will get a preloaded malicious software removal tool so you can use that tool to remove all the malicious software from your system so just press window key and r together on your keyboard and this will open the run command now here you have to type mrt so type mrt then press enter wait for 10 to 15 second you will see this kind of window microsoft windows malicious software removal tool so this is a preloaded tool you can use to remove a malicious software from your system click on next after that click on full scan then click on next so this will start scanning for malicious software so you can use this tool as well in the next step we are going to check our browser so i am using this chrome browser now you have to check for suspicious and unknown add-ons and extensions in your browser. So go to these three dots, click on these three dots. After that, uh, click on this option extensions, click on manage extension. Now if you see any kind of suspicious add-on or extension, simply remove that. Just click on remove to remove any extension from your Chrome browser. Next important thing is update your browser as well. So click on these three dots. Click on help then click on about chrome browser and update your browser as well so always use a updated browser the next and important thing you can also do is update your operating system so go to this search box and type update you will get this option check for updates click on it 
now here you have to update always update your operating system this is a very important thing you have to do so these are the few steps you can apply to protect your system this is all for the video thank you